love bugs is traveling back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed and doing blessed and how they were and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome to my returning subs, my grown extended beautiful family. Just thank you so much for the love and support. Um, you dropping these comments, allowing me to the share experiences that you're going through and being able to relate to so many things we never thought we would be able to relate to so with that being said much love to all namaste love and blessings love and light and many blessings are definitely coming your way and if you've been watching my videos for a while and have not already uh, please go ahead and like and subscribe even hit that notification bell so you know when i'm about to upload my next video and uh if you are comfortable enough, please drop me a line or two. I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video, or you're just up, tell me about your impact, the gift, and how it impacted your life, and heading you towards a positive direction. Also, if you feel like the video is giving you good vibes or even good information, you will love to share with a family or friend, or even a fellow empath that are really going through some trying times right now and they need confirmation or validation towards the life path or soul purpose or even just purpose altogether. Um, please go ahead and share while you're at it. Give me a thumbs up, like, and also share on your social media favorites wherever you see fit. And once again, thank you so much for the love and support. It is so greatly appreciated. And I'm, you know, I'm just glad I can be able to be a part of your journey and you're a part of mine. And I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video. Y'all, I'm sorry, my, my little cat Irma over here, I guess she felt my little vibes coming off. It's like, it's a blessing when you can actually have animals and they can tell, you know, when your energy shifts. She always comes over if I'm feeling sad or overwhelmed. She comes over and um, sit next to me so she can be able to take those vibes away. And then she, then she goes about her business. But today, um, I'm listening to Buddhist sleep music. All is energy, meditation, music, music for restor uh, restorative sleep, uh, 41705B, or whatever that is. But I will post that link in the description box below. I know y'all probably ask, why do you keep on having these, these negative vibes and all energy? Because with all of us going through all these crazy vibes, I love to put that one like in the background. You know, going through all these different things, you know, it's a good thing to be able to meditate and especially if you got a whole lot of energy going on or you just in a somber mood or whatever. But today my video is about Twin Flame 101, when the ascension is off the chain. Oh, y'all. <laughs> it's been crazy. You know, we're already going through karmic, karmic clearing. And it's just like going through all this stuff at the same time. It's like I floated. There's probably a lot of bloat. Um, solar plexus is acting all up. Um, I've been eating a lot of trail mix and stuff like that. You know, I've been doing water intake, but I guess I need to do more water. You know, I've been eating a lot of fruit. Uh, not even really been eating candy like I used to. You know, I sat up here and got my trail mix right here. And it has like, um, uh, what is it? Dried pineapples, uh, banana chips, and raisins, and dried papaya, and dried coconuts. I love those. I'll be eating the heck out of these. Um, but it's just like been really crazy. The the dreams is getting very intense. I had a dream the other night I was pregnant. I was like trying to sit, how am I gonna I was in a state of shock. Like how am I gonna post this on social media that I'm that I'm with child or whatever and I just started laughing. I was like, wait a minute, whoa. You know, um it was just really crazy. And then if you can see my arms, they're like I got I'm getting hives to the point it looks like bruises um, really bad all over my arm and the back of my neck and stuff and um, lost puppy if you watch this video I can't use that aloe vera it burns like crazy so I can't use that I guess I'm just gonna have to go through the motions emotional roller coaster all off the off it's all off the charts going through all these different symptoms um, it's hard for me to go to sleep at night so sometimes I got to take a sleep aid uh, not wanting to get up early in the morning either so it's just like even when I sleep it still feels like I didn't get enough sleep and it, it, I could have been sleeping for seven eight hours and it still feels like I am emotionally and mentally drained so it's just like a lot of uh, people have been posting stuff like you know if you, your body is uh, telling you sending you signals you really need to pay attention to it which you really do if you can take that time out to take a nap you know go ahead and do that uh, if you can 
you know, take one of those hot, relaxing showers, you know, candles lit, soft music and stuff like that. Do that. <laughs> so uh, just do whatever you need to do to go ahead and put yourself back in that that active vibe, that higher vibe. Because it's like ascension, if you're going through the ascension phase, is, is getting really, really crazy right now. But it said everything, they keep telling me this is necessary for you to have to go through because while you're clearing this stuff, you might end up going through Dark Night of the Soul a little bit, as well as the Kundalini as well. So they're they're hitting you all. I mean, they coming at you. It's just like, you know, when you, uh, I don't know why I used to take karate classes. <laughs> all these little crazy things you had to do, you know. Um, and then when it comes to the test, they, they're, they're sitting up here. You know, test you on so many different levels to, just to see if you learn a technique. You know, you remember the things that you were taught. You know, you got to be serious. You got to be able to focus and concentrate. And that's basically what we're doing as empaths because we are elevating in a higher realm. You know, we are releasing a lot of cords. We're cutting a lot of cords. So you're going through all these intense, strategic vibes. It's, it's just like everything is it, it's just like fickle. It makes me feel like I'm fickle, but <laughs> going through all those crazy situations, it, 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 it's just like, wow, going through this again. So it's just like, I don't know what it looks like. Mom, it looks like it's getting bad. And I mean, these, they feel like they hurt, but they don't hurt. It's just like my skin's is really sensitive, but it's like leaving knots. I don't know if y'all can really see it, but if you see all those, it looks like bruises all over my arms and it's just like really like sensitive. So I've been trying to put lotion and uh, some of my coconut oil on there. It helps at night, but that mess is just crazy. So if you're going through these things, trust and believe it's something. It's, it's normal. They said you had to go through this. It's just like you're, I mean, go ahead and question yourself. It'll make you feel like your ego is just really out of whack. You don't feel aligned. You feel imbalanced. It, it, it just have you all, having hot flashes like crazy. It's like I have the air on like 70 degrees in my house. And it's like I got wooden floors. So, you know, it, it stays cold in here. But it just seems like that wasn't enough for me. So I got my fan on. So dealing with all those different things is just been really crazy. So make sure you take time out for yourself. You know, like I said before, meditate if you need to. Because these have really been helping me. That's why I've been putting on the ones for negative blocks, uh, clearing, um, all positive vibes, raising your vibration, giving you a boost of energy because it's just like I get so tired, you know, after I do my videos and it's just like I'll be wanting to work out and I just don't have enough energy after I finish doing these. But, um, you know, I told myself I was going to go ahead and take off today, but I was like, you know what, there's a lot of things I just want to get off my chest because, I, like I said, I love doing these videos. It's like a therapeutic outlet for me, you know, knowing. I'm not the only one going through this and just it can ease somebody's mind to let them know that you're not the only one experiencing these things because it's scary when you got to go through these spiritual awakenings, ascension, dark night of the soul, um, generational curse clearing and, you know, karmatic cycle clearing, all these different things we are getting, uh, we're edging towards that completion of a emotional chapter of our lives we're shedding a lot of faucets you know we're letting go of a lot of things we're seeing you know what we need to let go of what we need to cut away from our lives you know what we need to walk away from so yes things are getting very intense right now but it's for a positive purpose you know hopefully <laughs> this will be it i'm hoping and praying this will be it but it's just like they keep on telling me that this is very necessary we gotta go through even though i might make you feel like you're a ball of nuts you know basically you know going through this stuff i was like man i feel so you know they already think we're crazy anyway so it makes you feel like you're really intense crazy so it, it just all these different emotions you're going through you know you can be happy one minute you know I'm, i've just been congratulating a whole bunch of people uh it's been having a lot of blessings come in their life you know i'm happy for them and it's just like you're seeing people going through sad moments i end up bursting out into tears like you know you're really feeling everybody's energy it's just like i can watch certain videos like i don't watch tv unless it's like on sunday and monday that's the only time i watch it but it's always not during you know the actual time so i dvr it so i am exposed to all the other things that go on so i know what, what to look at and what not to so all those different things has been very intensified you know um being able to feel all that energy and it's just like you're soaking it up as well 
So, you know, if you got crystals, you know, try to meditate with your crystals. You know, if you got the, you know, like Florida water or stuff like that, your incense, please burn it and please use the water. So I hope this is able to help you put your mind at ease to let you know you are not alone. Um, this is a positive course that we have to go through, even though it might feel negative, you know, it's, it's allowing your emotions, you know, you have to clear all this stuff out of your emotions. It's like all the memories and trauma and all these things are coming up. So it's just like you might have a good few, you know, three or four days and it'll set you even a week. You know, I know uh, one of my love bugs was telling me they had a good week and all of a sudden it took them right back. You know, so it's going to have you feeling like you're going to step back five paces. You know, I kept on crying to my dad and say, I'm sorry, I'm feeling this way. I'm so sorry. And he's like, it's okay. Stop saying you're sorry. <laughs> you you got to go through this. So, you know, just be able to give you that kind of comfort to let you know you're not going through this alone. Um, I'm sending so much love and vibes towards y'all. I mean, these meditations is really helping me. So it makes me feel so much better and I feel so blessed to be able to experience this and know that I can relate to people and people can relate to me. You know, and it doesn't make me feel that bad, <laughs> even though I hate the fact that you're going through this as well, because it, it can get unbearable. So please be gentle with yourself. Give yourself that time. You know, don't force yourself to be trying to let go of something so quick just because you're ready to jump onto the next chapter. I did that myself and then do nothing but make it worse. So like, be able to go through the motions and know that you will be okay. And I will talk to you on my next video. I'm going to give my post notification shout out to Mimi B. Much love to you and congratulations on your new job. Um, Bam Bam JD23 and J86. Much love to you and I'll see you on my next video. Drop me a line and let me know if you're feeling these things or you're going through all these different situations and up and down too. I would love to be able to hear and be able to relate to your story. Like and subscribe. Give me a thumbs up and also share. And I will see you on my next video. Much love to y'all. Peace and be wild. Well.